There are semester exams coming up, so you guys make sure to study. That's it. Man, it's finally test season. Two months flew by after I started my junior year in high school. I, Mao Yagi, was not in a good mood. It's not that I didn't like tests or anything. I look pretty normal, but my test scores aren't too bad. The problem is... What are you staring into nothing for? Are you stupid or something? You're the stupid one. Her name was Haruna Hirose, and she looks cool and intelligent. She is a childhood friend, and we live next to each other. We got along back in the day, but recently we just kind of bump heads. The reason I really didn't like this season was because of her. Haruna, I'm not even sure if it's worth asking, but are you good for your next exam? You fool, you think that I'm able to pass on my own? Right. Every time she comes to me and asks for help, she always barely passes. She's managing because I help her out, but I'm worried about her future. Her parents have also asked me to help her out, so I have to help her till we graduate, but there are a lot of people here. I think they're starting to work on fixing up the classrooms. Oh, that makes sense. The library was practically full, which was rare. Whatever the case, we didn't have anywhere to study, so we decided to go home. All right, I guess we aren't going to study today? No, we do have to study. What, are we going to study in your room then? I would like to, but I have someone over, so we gotta go to your room instead. W what? Uh, my room? No, 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 no. You're acting out of character. <laughs> of course not. You think I'm some kind of pervert? What are you talking about? How is that the conclusion you reach? Fine. You just have to wait a little because my room is a mess. Yeah, yeah. Aruna went home and rushed into her room. I could hear things moving around from outside. How much of a mess was her house? <sighs> All right. You can come inside. Thanks. It's been so long since I've been in your house. We often went to each other's houses back in the day, but now I find myself a little nervous. I went upstairs and walked into her room, but it was just like a regular girl's room. You know, for a girl who acts so cool all the time, you like a lot of cute girly stuff, don't you? You got all those stuffed animals on your bed. Don't look so much. Oh, my bad, sorry. What is going on? It's like the first time a boyfriend went to his girlfriend's room or something. But whatever, well, let's get started studying. We don't have much time. R right, thanks. What is going on here? We've known each other for so long. The more time I spend here, the more awkward it got. I was thinking about running to the bathroom for a second when... Uh, oh, I haven't given you any snacks or anything. Yeah. I'm going to go get ready, so give me a second. Sure. I can't believe things get so awkward just by a change in scenery. Hmm? Maybe I have a chance to get my revenge? Truth be told, Haruna sometimes went through my phone without asking. She said she wanted to know if I wasn't looking at any weird sites or anything. No matter how much I change my password, she manages to crack the code. I'm a healthy boy in high school. I was, of course, interested in that sort of thing. I'm going to give her a taste of her own poison. Let's see. Her password is probably her birthday. I quickly entered her birthday and popped into her phone. Hmm, let's see what she searches every day. Did I just look at something that I shouldn't have? I'm sure it's just random. Oh, she hates me. What about her photos? Uh, let's pretend I didn't see that. Yeah, who knows what she's thinking. What are you doing on my phone? Oh, uh, it was on the ground, so I just picked it up. You saw, didn't you? But what are you talking about? I saw nothing. I tried to pretend I didn't know what was going on, but it was too late. Haruna saw what I saw. She snatched the phone out of my hand and glared at me. Then I felt guilty. I'm sorry, but it's your fault too. You sometimes go through my phone. That's because I wanted to see if you were still getting along with your ex. Well, that doesn't mean you should just look through someone's phone. I know, I know that that means you hate me, but I was worried. No matter how cool or distant I act, you don't seem to like me. Wait, so you thought that I was interested in cool and distant hard-to-get girls? You aren't? Not at all. Where did you even get that information? You liked cool, beautiful girls in the animes that we used to watch. I thought that's the type of girl you liked. Well, yeah, in an anime, sure, but... Uh... Then what is your type? I'll make sure to play the part. No, that's not what I'm saying. No matter how much she changed into my type, she was still my childhood friend. 
We had treated each other like we were siblings, so I couldn't just change the way I looked at her. Then you've only ever looked at me as a childhood friend? Yeah, you're like a very important sister to me. S sorry Fine, but I'm a girl and I'm not going to give up. You better be ready. What was I supposed to be ready for? I didn't understand, but I would soon come to find out. Mao, morning. Morning. You seem like you're in a good mood. How long has it been since we've gone to school together? Since like elementary school, I think. Since you're not into cool girls, I'm just going to do what I want. Uh, okay. So, we're going to be all over each other starting today. No, get off me! No, I said I'm not giving up. Okay, you don't have to push that onto me. This is part of the plan, a seduction kind of thing. You idiot, you think I'm gonna fall for... Hey, you pitching a tent there, buddy? It's just a wrinkle, get off me. She used to be more likable and easygoing when she was in elementary school. Was she this annoying when she was just being herself? Her assault was unrelenting. Mal, I made you a bento, so I want you to eat it. Oh, thanks. I didn't know you could cook. I hope you didn't put anything weird in it. Let's go on a date next weekend. No. What? Come on, please. I'll study hard on my test, okay? If you work twice as hard compared to usual, uh, I'll think about it. Yay, it's done. There were times it felt really out of the blue, but... She was very serious about all of this and didn't have any bad intentions, so I was definitely slowly being attracted to her. I didn't think that I would ever start looking at my childhood friend like that ever. Was there a reason we had to meet up? We live next door to each other. Sorry for being late. I had to take my time getting ready. Oh yeah, I just got... What's wrong? Oh, uh... Do I look funny? I tried pretty hard for today. Not at all. You look really good. Uh, if anything, I think you put in a little too much effort. <laughs> whoa, 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 I can't look at you directly, you're too cute. <laughs> you're blushing, how rare. It was so funny. No, I'm just happy is all. Come on, let's not waste any time, let's go. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if we should be doing this and we should be studying for tests. I was worried I would slowly rot away, but at the same time, I was having so much fun on this date. Thank you for coming out with me. I had a lot of fun today. No, no, thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. Damn it, why do I think you're so cute today? Hey, Mao, I have something I want to talk to you about. Do you have a sec? Hmm? If I get above a 50 on everything for the next round of exams, um, will you go out with me as a treat? I think a 50 is not really worthy of that. R right. <laughs> I just said it because I figured, what the heck, uh, don't worry about it. Sure. Huh? I mean, I'm not counting on it or anything, but good luck. I don't think you'll get it, though. Yeah, I'm going to work hard so you can look forward to it. I said I'm not going to look forward to it. A few weeks later, we had our rounds of exams. A week later, we got our tests handed back, but... All the scores on all of the subjects this time around are way too low. It's almost from a vacation, but I want you all to study every day. That's it. I mean... I scored the usual, but Haruna probably barely passed. I kind of understood this time around, but... Mal? Y yeah, I'm getting ready now. Sh sure, um, that's okay, but do you have time this evening? I want you to come over. Huh? Sure. What was it? She's been acting very worried recently, and it's making me worry too. Welcome in. Sorry for taking your time after school. Uh, no problem? Her parents, who are normally both out for work, were here. I thought maybe they were off today or something, so they invited me to the living. There was a deeply upset and depressed Haruna already there. Um, uh, what's going on? We're all having a talk about what's going to happen with Haruna. Okay, but why do I need to be here? Well, we need you to be here because you're always taking care of her during exams. I think you need to be here to see what happens to her. Uh-huh. I wasn't sure what was going on, but the meeting started. It was about Haruna's grades. They were unrelenting in their attack on her scores. Haruna, we told you before that if you just studied enough, you wouldn't score so bad. Why are your scores so bad this time? Well... Haruna, explain so that we understand. Can I explain? 
Huh? I'm not one to cover for her because she normally does skip out on her studies, but this time around, everyone scored pretty low and the average was at its lowest too. The teacher said it was a difficult exam. I'm ranking in at the usual place too, but score-wise, it's pretty low. I don't think you need to really give her that hard of a time over these exams. Mal... This is just my personal opinion, but Haruna tried pretty darn hard to try to pass these exams. I think she even improved her rankings too. So, how about you just let this go for now? Malcoon, I understand you want to let it go, but we're worried about our daughter's future. As long as this continues, we have to start thinking about taking action. Action? We've been talking about moving Haruna to a different school that would force her to study. If she is accepted there, then she will have to be in a dorm till she graduates. We don't want to live apart from our daughter, so we wanted to see her scores on the next test, but... I don't want to move schools. I don't want to live apart from Mao. I'm against that too. You're not even asking for her opinion? That's too much. This is for her greater good, though. I need her to succeed in the future, so this is a necessary evil. I was almost even shocked by this sudden conversation. Just imagining Haruna being gone makes my heart sink. Just a little while back, I thought she was just a childhood friend, but now I can tell I'm in love with her. I didn't know how to tackle this impossible situation. Saying anything here would only make things worse. I needed to do something. You two are okay as long as she does well, right? Right. And she's able to go down a path that you guys are okay with? Correct. Okay, then give her to me. Huh? I'll make sure she's happy. I don't want to say that she's going to be completely secure for a future, but you should feel a little better. Aruna, what do you think? I want to be Mal's wife. Please, I'm begging you too. I didn't think I'd make a public proposal either, but... Are you sure about this? Taking care of someone is not as easy as it sounds. I'm not saying this half-assed. I love her the most in the world. Mal, I love you too. Okay then, I think you can take good care of her. Take care of her. Thank you. We started dating with marriage as part of the deal. It's not like anything had changed, but apparently she was pretty popular amongst the boys, so they would all glare at me. However, I was totally fine with it, as this was only possible because she was mine. Or so I thought. I did not think it would go that well. Right? When you proposed like that, I just couldn't stop grinning, so I was a little worried you'd figure it out, but... What's wrong? You look so surprised that you can't even find the words to say. Of course not. You totally tricked us. The whole story about moving schools was a complete lie to me, to get me admit my feelings for her. Ugh, I should have known with how obvious it all was. There's no way that she would be able to get into that good of a school anyway. In other words, I was the target all along. Yeah, pretty much. I figured you would be able to take good care of her. Good guys fly off the shelves, so it'll be too late if you don't act fast. Seriously? And Haruna seemed to like you too. We wanted you two to get together. <laughs> the methodology was kind of sus, but we were able to actually get together, so that was nice. I gotta be careful so these two don't manipulate me like that again. Why are you all on me anyway? It's fine, we're in days. That doesn't mean you can just do whatever you want. Yeah, no kids either. You two are still students. No, of course not. We don't even do stuff like that. Huh? We don't? We do? If something does happen, we'll all help you raise the child. That's a little too lenient, don't you think? Then we've got our dad's blessing, so... Were you listening to me? No! Thank you for watching. How was today's video? Please check out our other videos as well.